Hey everyone, welcome to this week's update. I hope everybody had a good week of trading. Quick look at the markets and then we'll jump into the trades, starting with VIX. Uh, VIX got annihilated this week, uh, spent some time under 13, closing at 13.06. New all time high in SPX, hit a high of 52.61. All time high in NDX yesterday at 18,464. Dow hit a new high yesterday, 398, call it 399. Uh, Rut had an up week, but not a new all-time high, settling in at 2072. Uh, Gold also hit a new all-time high, 2,225. Up week at the beginning for silver, finished lower. Uh, Notes and bonds both higher 10-year 10-year yield settling in below 4.2. Oil, a little bit down on the week. Natty gas, a little bit lower on the week. Grains, uh, all three grains kind of chopping back and forth. Uh, Euro and the pound sold off the last couple days. A little bit of strength in the U.S. dollar. And Bitcoin taking a break from all-time highs this week, settling in at 63,600. All right, so trades for the week. Had another good week, so good back-to-back weeks. Um, let's go with zero DTE to start. So for zero DTE, a little over 39K. Uh, my challenge portfolio, which is made up of a couple of re-entry zero DTE strategies, reverse iron condors, and one DTE, uh, had a really strong week. And uh, some other things that had a good week were uh, my PM tranches, my quiet day tranches, uh, power hour, had a, had a little bit of red, uh, but overall for zero DTE, really good week. Uh, so I will take it. I had, had, finding a little consistency the last couple of weeks, so that's always good. Um, all right, next on the list, Iron Ducks just had one. One duck closed small winner 280. Uh, by the way, shout out to my boy Brad F for helping me out with the uh, Trader Sync. So, so I don't have to click through all the different setups. I have them custom tagged, so it makes it a little bit easier. So dynamic butterflies, uh, two of those, one win, one loss, uh, basically a scratch, minus 145 on the week between those two trades. Um, let's see next on the list, dynamic calendars plus 2,200 had a six, seven. That was a nice winner. A three, five. That was a decent loser. A four, five. That was a decent winner. Some of these others just plus or minus a thousand. Yeah. So those were the decent ones, but plus 2,200 overall on calendars, uh, option selling. So two small winners on short strangles, one in Natty Gas, one in Corn. Ended up take, didn't hit profit target on those, but did take them off for small winners. And then uh, lastly, portfolio margin, a couple of winners. Had a, a couple of reverse vertigos that were winners, one for 630, one for 1780, and then a Humpty Vertical for plus 470. So... All in all, between all strategies, a little over 43K for the week um, on top of a, a really nice week last week. So good to be back to con- some consistent profits. Hope we keep this going. Uh, don't forget, next week is a short week. Good Friday. Market is closed. Uh, so everybody have a good weekend. Talk to you next week.